So it is not a prediction, it is an idea, a thought, a thing that I think will happen in the World Series. Because there's two teams that are really good right now at the break of the MLB season. And the second half is coming up. And the two teams that are really good right now is Houston and LA Dodgers. And I think they will be in the World Series. I know, the World Series, them? Holy cow. These teams used to be at the bottom of the barrel. Well, not, not the Dodgers. They were really a team that was always really good, but they could never get themselves out of the basement of being anywhere in the playoffs and get themselves anywhere in the playoffs. Yes, they were always kicked out of the playoffs and they were done for. But I think this year that they will make a run I think Houston is just going to be keeping rolling over, rolling over, and rolling over every team that they see. Because that's pretty much what Houston has been doing. Their last win was 19-4. to That's ridiculous. And the team that I pick to win the World Series, hmm. Well, let's look at it. Dodgers, 50, 50 wins. I think it's 54 wins. I'm not sure. I'd have to look. I know the Astros are almost 60 wins and they are really doing something that no team has done. They are ahead of their division. They are ahead of everybody. Nobody's going to catch them. Nobody's going to catch the Dodgers. Well, they might. Somebody might catch the Dodgers, but it's a long shot. It's a really, really long shot of anybody catching the Dodgers. So. If you are just thinking in your head, you're making a prediction. Well, no, I'm not making a prediction. I'm making a, I'm having an idea in my head and talking about it, and I'm having a thought. And if I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. Because sometimes I'm not always right, but sometimes I'm always right. But not in the case of a lot of stuff. But so. How many games and how many wins? I say maybe it'll go back and forth. Maybe it'll be a blowout between the two teams, one of the two teams. But we'll just have to find out and see because this will be an awesome matchup. The Dodgers, the Astros, them playing against each other and seeing that the National League finally goes down and it is the Astros, the Houston Astros, a Texas team wins the World Series and they get the trophy and they say, thank you, I thank you for the new car because they always give them new cars. I don't get that. Uh, the guy that hit the home run, Robinson Cano, he gets a new car for hitting the home run in, in the All-Star game? What is this, a car dealership in the M MLB? Jeez, if I went to my job every day and I got a new car, or like, a, or maybe a Smoothie King, I'd go for both, maybe. I don't know if I would want a new car, but maybe a Smoothie King. Every day you go to work, you get a new Smoothie King. Oh, dude. Hey, um, anyways, they are really nice cars too, like sports cars. So they can be sportsy. That was a terrible joke, but sportsy. <laughs> That's another subject for another day, but. I just had to say something about it because I don't get it. You can give a car to a guy for winning the World Series and a car to Robinson to know for winning the American for the All-Star game? Jeez. The ratings must be in the dumps. They must not get any viewers for the World Series or the All-Star game. <clears throat> but if the Dodgers win it, Hmm. They will finally say, hey, we are no more in a drought of the playoffs. And it's not just us getting in the playoffs. It's us winning and getting deeper. And we won the freaking World Series. Now, 
put that in your pipe and smoke it because we are legit to quit oh no not another song there we go then with some more songs in my, my speech pediment at least my speech pediment isn't like uh, uh, blah 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 like i usually do but oh geez two teams that i don't really have any interest in but those are the two teams that i think will go to the world series and win it but it might be something different some team might come up and just knock the crap out you get some mo mo momentum and just steamroll over everybody you know the MLB is a very unpredictable uh, animal to look at because you never know what you're going to get. The same with football. The same with basketball. You don't know what you're going to get in the playoffs with football or basketball. You don't know what you're going to get with the MLB playoffs. So if Houston does what they do, what they did in the first half, then they're going to be fine. If Dodgers are doing the same thing in the second half, they'll be fine. But we'll just have to see. But remember, these teams can be doing great for a while, and then all of a sudden they could be just plummeting down and come back to Earth when they're up in outer space doing awesome freaking things, like having these ridiculous score after before the all-star break that is just freaking ridiculous i can't believe astros did that so we're gonna have to watch we're gonna have to look and we're gonna have to see if i'm right but if i'm not then it was just a thought it was just the idea it was not a prediction because i don't like making predictions now, i know people are saying you you always do make predictions no 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 I don't make predictions and I will never will. So, as always, baby, awesome radical calabunga.